Hi, this video is brought to you by TechDirectArchive.com. In this video, I'll be showing you how to check what files are taking up space on your Windows system. There are some times that um, you notice or you will notice that uh, something is taking up important space on your system. You check your system space some couple of minutes or hours ago and after some time you recheck again you find out that those space are no longer there so what exactly is causing this issue i'll be showing you how to quickly confirm that and what you need to do so um on your system go to settings go to settings inside the settings by your right on that system scroll down when you scroll down you see storage click on it so um this will show you the current things that are using um, your storage the apps and features the desktop documents we also have the temporary files and if you want to see more categories you can click this this will show you more categories of what is uh, taking up space on your system and if you want to uh, for instance like this temporary files you can delete it you can uninstall any application you no longer need and if it is uh, uh, taking up some uh, important space on your system you can uninstall you can delete files you can remove folders so this is one way you can do that to create more space on your system to create more storage another way you can check what exactly is uh, eating up space on your system is uh, there's a third party tool that you can make use of though this third party tool works but you are going to use it at your own risk so i will not um encourage you to install it directly on your system first you can try it on a sandbox we have windows sandbox which uh, you can use to install that uh, third party tool or application and you can test it there before you can now install it on your system so the sandbox we always uh, separate your physical system from uh, the uh, sandbox itself i'm talking about the window sandbox so whatever you whatever action you take on your window sandbox it does not affect your physical system so let me go into my sandbox now okay i already have it up but let me just close it and start again so anytime you close your sandbox everything you are currently doing on it will get wiped off so it does not save does not keep anything for you so um i'm going into the sandbox now so are we sandbox so it's coming up it's coming up now so so while it is up there is this command that I will be using to install that third party tool. So that third party tool is uh, Win. Uh, let me just say W I N D R S T A T. Win die start. So I hope I um, I get the pronunciation right. So this is just the command you are going to make use of. Um, so I'm going to launch my power sure now um let me use admin let me open it as admin so once 
once it's up, I will try it. I'll try to use that command to install. So let's okay. So let me paste. I will hit enter. So let's see whether this the widget is going to install that too. So you can see why D0 is coming up is because we currently do not have Winget installed on our sandbox. So we have to install Winget first. So after installing that Winget, then you cannot use the Winget to install that uh, application, that third party too. So how do we install Winget on sandbox? You make use of this um, script here. Yeah? You can use this script so i'm going to copy this script now this script is available online anyway so it's very fast to use so i'm going to paste it so once you paste it hit enter so after some time your widget will be installed your windows package will be installed so after installing it then you can now make use of it so let's wait briefly for it to install for it to install so so I, I think we're going to come back by then it should be done so after some um, seconds or minutes it depends on how good your network is the uh, widget will be installed so now to confirm whether your widget is installed or not just enter widget here and hit enter so we are good now our widget is uh, finally up and running so um if i copy that same command again this widget install if i copy and paste here now we are not going to see that earlier error again i'm going to hit enter now so the third party tool should start installing now as you can see it's currently installing so it will soon be done so once it's done then we are going to launch it so it's just an analyzer okay click it's it is asking me some question here so type yes So it's downloading it now from that uh, location. So this uh, tool is just um, a disk analyzer. It's going to analyze your disk and uh, help you to know what exactly is eating up your space or your storage. So it is successfully installed now. So if you want to launch it, just go to search here and type win dir sdat so that's it that's the hub so just click on it launch it so you can see two selection here all local drives or individual drives so do i ha i have just one drive on my system so i just click okay so it's going to scan so it's currently scanning the folders the files your drive to scan everything and it will analyze everything for you and you get to know what exactly is eating up your space you can delete you can uninstall whatever uh way you want to go or any route you want to go so this is um, a very good tool that you can make use of but be careful in using it because it's a third-party tool or application is not from uh, Windows 
uh, from Microsoft, I mean, from Microsoft itself. So uh, just the way I first installed it on my Windows sandbox, you can do that as well. So as just to be safe to test it first before you go ahead, because while using it, you are using it at your own risk. So I hope you enjoyed this video and thank you for watching.